three, two. living your best life. Thanks to 2020, I think that we can all agree that we're just gonna say F you to that phrase, right? I'm sure a lot of people questioned, how could you live your best life? You see, the thing is that I can sit here and list all the shitty things that happened in 2020, right? But I think that we all have pretty much the same idea of how shitty it really was. are now deciding who lives and who dies from the virus. New warning tonight. The U.S. does not have enough coronavirus test kits to meet the current demand. The U.S. has now surpassed 4 million cases of coronavirus. So here's the biggest truth about 2020 in my life. It was the greatest year because it taught me who I am. Regardless of the things that happened, every year is gonna have something shitty that happens. But it's how we respond to that and how we come back from that that really matter. How we fought back, how we rose to the top. That's just the human race, man. Like, we're so resilient. But with that being said, I want to think of 2020 as not not as a year that was the shittiest year, but to instead look at it and flip that idea and saying that this was probably the best year that I could have. You know, despite all the bad things that have happened, these are things that we can sit and dwell on, but outside of that, what did we learn from 2020? In 2020, I accomplished a lot. I made a lot of videos. I collabed with people that just helped me find my passion. I did a quarantine wedding. I did a wedding before the quarantine hit. can look at it in a different perspective this is how I see it that no matter all the bad that happened in 2020 you gained a lot of good
So since we're <laughs> since we're from all different states, well not all different states, but we're not all together. We doing gingerbread houses the FaceTime way. All said and done, living your best life, it's not that 2020 made that not possible because if you look at it in a different perspective, you did live your best life because you had to. We all did. We had to make the best of everything, right? And we did that. We did that, dude. Like, give yourself a pat on the back, you know? Round of applause, give yourself a hug, hug the person beside you and tell them the same thing, that you did that. You did live your best life in 2020, regardless of all the shit that happened, man. You made this count. So going into 2021, make that one count too. Bring this experience into 2020 and be like, dude, I, yeah, I'm living my best life. I am going to do what I need to do in 2021 because I did that shit in 2020. I survived the quarantine. I survived COVID. Thank you, 2020. Thank you for being that asshole to open my eyes that slapped me in the face and I was like, what the f Oh, I get it. You know, now I understand. I can do this. I'm a badass motherfucker.